Hey guys, it's Bob Bean back today with another video and today we will be doing the Dr. Pepper Cherry Review. It's just regular cherry, not dark berry, just regular cherry Dr. Pepper. And now we will be trying this out, we'll be putting it in a clear glass first, so let's get started. Alright, so let's start by opening it. Nice. Ooh. They actually colored this one, which is cool. Look how much fizz there is. Holy cow. Can't really see it very well, but you can see the froth and how it's very red. That is nice. I was a little disappointed by um the dark berry Dr. Pepper, how it was just brown, but this they kind of colored. And I appreciate that. It kind of just adds to the experience, especially when it's red. All right, so here's the can one more time. It's kind of like a teal, a really dark teal. I like the design, very modern, very swirly, very simplistic. And on the side, they have, you have your little dinosaur dudes right there. Jurassic World, nice. All right, let's try cherry, not dark berry, cherry Dr. Pepper. That is good. So, right up the, um, right in the center there, you got your Dr. Pepper. And on the side, you have the cherry, which is what a good combo drink like this should do. Like, when you have a Dr. Pepper or a Coke, um, a good example of this, of like it being an actual side flavor and not just right up front, is Coke vanilla. Cause you drink the Coke, you taste the Coke, and then at the back end, you have that vanilla. Now this, this isn't like that. It's very nice because you know Dr. Pepper, it's no one loved. You know what this drink tastes like and has to offer. And it doesn't diminish that. It combos it well instead of just taking all the flavor from it. This is really well done. I really like this. It almost tastes like um, regular Dr. Pepper already has cherry. And it feels like they just added more or they just doubled the recipe. It, it tastes really nice. It's a, it has a nice aftertaste. And it, I don't know why, but I think for me, cherry drinks like cherry Coke, cherry Pepsi, tastes smoother. So this, it feels smoother. Um, and it just, it just is a really solid drink. I feel like this is... I think like cherry is one of the best side flavorings you can add in a cola or a pop. That being said, it's pretty good. Um, I like how it's just not super overpowering as opposed to other drinks. Mountain Dew kind of has a problem with this. Mountain Dew, when they're making other kinds of flavors, which isn't necessarily bad, but they completely destroy your expectations of what it's gonna taste like. They're not taking the Mountain Dew formula and adding something to it like this does. Like, you're not, the Dr. Pepper is taking Dr. Pepper and adding cherry to it. They're not reworking the entire recipe like Mountain Dew does. Mountain Dew will take, they'll take an abstract idea or the brand name of Mountain Dew and then just do whatever the heck they want, which is okay, but it's kind of disappointing when you know and love your Mountain Dew and then it's not Mountain Dew, you know what I mean? But overall, I think Dr. Pepper Cherry is a very solid drink. If you like uh, fruity flavors, I highly suggest this. It's a very solid drink, and it would be in my top 10, I think. It's very solid, no really pro real problems, but it does feel a little safe, but you gotta have that safe space. I will give this like an eight or a seven out of 10, very strong and a really good drink to have. And it kind of limits itself with the cherry taste because it does get old after a while if you drink a lot of cans at a time which is why it, it's good to have it in small quantities like one can and just wait a while so i do like that i like how it kind of limits itself but that being said thank you for watching i really appreciate it have a great day and i'll see you guys in the next video